Don Goodwin. I'm a lieutenant colonel. I'm a chaplain in the United States Army Reserve, uh, 143rd ESC out of Orlando, Florida. And I was sharing with this gentleman here concerning my uh, my conversion to the Christian faith. Uh, I was involved in a satanic coven in Fort Riley, Kansas back in 1973. And I came to Christ one night when uh, they were working witchcraft on me. And I had a Gideon's Bible. And from that Gideon's Bible, I heard God's word and called upon the Lord and got saved. Amen. Praise God. What about the satellite in the in the intelligence gathering and the, and the signal that you were talking about? The signal gathering intelligence aspect of it. You said satellites. Oh, oh I was, uh, yeah, my, my vocation, what I did with First MI Company uh, was I was an airborne sensor specialist. And I uh, was the... Uh, Air crewman with a uh, OV-1 A, B, C, and D model uh, Mohawk, and we gathered, uh, you know, infrared information by flyovers. We also had a a um, uh, radar system called SLAR, side-looking airborne radar, and we would gather information uh, 25 to 50 miles behind enemy lines, staying in our airspace that was legal. And uh, we also had a panoramic camera in the nose. And um, my job was to operate the airborne radar. It was also to operate the Doppler navigation system. How were these Satanists involved in the military? Okay, that's a good question. As, as I came to discover this group that I was inadvertently being drawn into, after I became a Christian, I began to have my eyes opened about who was involved in this coven. Uh, we had the, the, the most senior person was a sergeant first class uh, out of Ithaca, New York, is where he, he name? was from. Uh, his name was Jim Short. And uh, he was working witchcraft with uh, others in this group. Uh, some of the names I can, I remember one guy named Thomas Becker. I remember another guy named Bill. I can't remember his last name. Ritual but, abuse, sacrifice. No, they, you know, the thing was, was uh, they, they were drawing me into it. Any NSA involvement that you know of or CIA? No, no. We had we had the Army Security Agency right next door, but, you know, we, as far as I know, uh, I don't know the level of the involvement beyond... They were trying to bring you in. They were trying to bring me in, and they were there was mind control because, of course, uh, you know, the Prince of the Power of the Air does have power over people's minds to keep people blinded to the truth. And thank God Christ opened my eyes up Jesus. and I came to faith. But there was a group in this military intelligence company, there, and I guess there's about 12 that were in this group as I moved on after my conversion. And uh, we began to, we had some conflicts at times, uh, but uh, they were very secretive, very uh, clandestine. But they had tried to get me into their group on November the 10th, 1973, was when I came to faith. November the 12th was my birthday, and they were trying to uh, suck me into the group and initiate me, I believe, on November the 12th. Praise God for you, sir. Uh, yeah. Anything and right, today, today.